We're all kind of playing this parlor game of trying to figure out which coalition we're going to see. It really comes down to the math, though. I mean, it's very close math to when you look at uh, the polls right now. Right, Matt. And that's what makes the race for third place in this election based on the polls right now. So uh, exciting, if you like. Uh, I mean, it looks very much like uh, the Christian Democrats led by Angela Merkel, uh, who has had three terms, will uh, win the most votes. Uh, the Social Democrats are polling second right now. Those two parties, as uh, Mr. Kellner points out, have been in this so-called grand coalition of the two biggest parties now. And the question is, uh, you know, the whole deck could be reshuffled on uh, election night. Tony, will this, will this election be decisive, i.e., will it produce a German government? Most likely, yes. I mean, there is always the possibility. Uh, I mean, there was talk in Britain, of course, of a hung parliament, which is, which is much more difficult than Germany. Uh, or to see in Germany because there's uh, there's more parties in the parliament, uh, but uh, there is an outside chance, and people have told us this, uh, of new elections if it really produces a complete deadlock. Now that would be very very unlike German politics, though. But 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 you know if the SPD doesn't want to play ball, if they don't want to go back into a grand coalition again and would prefer to be in the opposition. Um, which could make some strategic sense for the next election, then you have to get the Greens and the FDP, at least with today's polling numbers, to agree to a Jamaica coalition. It doesn't seem that either one of those uh, smaller parties really wants to do that. That may be what they're saying now. On the hmm. night, we're going we're gonna to see what they say, or I should say after 6 p.m., as we were just told. Yeah. Um, obviously, the, uh, he, uh, uh, the uh, green official that we had on the show is right that it's a very tough matchup. The Green Party, an environmentalist party in this kind of free market, slightly uh, right of center, free democratic party. But, you know, deals have been cut before. And Angela Merkel has governed with two different partners during her 12 years. But this one would be difficult.